There are two ways to figure out which element is represented by this electron configuration here on the periodic table. So the first way is just simply to count up all of these electrons here and figure out how many electrons we have for this configuration here. When we do that, we see that we have a total of 36 electrons for this electron configuration. The periodic table, all of the elements on the periodic table, they're neutral. So we can look at the atomic number. That's this number above these elements here. So 2, 10, 18, 36. The atomic number is the number of protons. And since all of these are neutral, the atomic number will equal the number of electrons. Protons and electrons are equal in a neutral element. So we just need to find the element here that has 36 as its atomic number. That's right here, krypton. So we know that this electron configuration ending in 4s2, 4p6, that's going to be krypton. We could also write this in abbreviated notation. Right now it's in the long form electron configuration. So we just find the noble gas before krypton. That's argon with 18. So we find 18 electrons here. And we could just write AR for all of this. So we end up with this condensed notation here for krypton. Same thing, we've just condensed all of this down to AR. Note that sometimes you'll see the 4S before the 3D, both of these notations here. Just something to be aware of. We could also look at the periodic table broken up into orbital blocks. So we're looking for something that ends in 4P6. So we go 1S1, 1S2, the S orbitals are full. 2S1, 2S2, we have that there. P has up to 6, so 2P1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then we have 3s2, 3p6, go to 4s2. From 4s2, we go to 3d10. At this point, we've used 30 of the electrons. We have 36, and we're looking for 4p6. So 4p1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this will be the element that has this electron configuration. That's going to be krypton, just like we found before. This is Dr. B figuring out which element has the electron configuration of 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 3d10, 4s2, 4p6. It's Krypton. Thanks for watching.